Hey everybody, so today I'm just doing some door dashing. I'm gonna do the dinner shift. Hopefully we'll get some good orders. I got my coffee and it was actually free because there was a long wait at the drive-thru, so he just gave it to me and I was like, thanks dude. Okay, so we're starting off the day good. First order is Buffalo Wild Wings for six miles for about seven, for about 7.50. Let's do this. Oh, hello. Thank you. So I just got an order to BJ's Brew House for eight something for like three miles. And it doesn't say the miles on the when I got it because I think I was in the area where I had like bad service but I did the calculations and it's about three miles. Like, okay, that's a pretty good one, so I will take that. Also, what I don't like about the roads where I live, and if you know San Antonio, you know like there's a lot of this, where if you wanna go somewhere, sometimes you have to go like all the way down a highway and then do like a U-turn and then go back the other way. You can't just cross or whatever. That's really annoying, but that's how the roads are here. A few moments later. Eventually. Hi. I have a pickup for Andrea P. Andrea P. Perfect. I yeah. think that one will be out earlier when it's free on Friday. Okay, perfect. For Andrea? Thank you. So I dropped that off and I'm just waiting for another order. Have you guys noticed that if you don't, like if you get an order and you don't decline it, you just like let the timer run out, that the next order you get will be the same one. Why don't they just give it to somebody else? I know there's other people around me dashing. And then there'll be times where like, I won't get any orders for like 15, 20 minutes. And then next thing I know, I'm just getting order back to back to back to back to back. Is it the app or? Just let me know in the comment section below what your thoughts are on that. It's kind of annoying when I like, I let the timer run out. So I just don't want to mess with it while I'm driving. And then I get another one and it's the same exact one. Why don't you send it to somebody else? I'm sure there's somebody else within like a, five mile radius. So I just got an order for Plantology and Panera of $9 for four point something miles. I would pick up. Bruh. I'm oh, sorry. Sorry, yeah, Justin P. Uh, Justin. Oh, I think this no. is one. Uh, <laughs> just make sure this is correct. Okay, I think it should be everything here. That's it. Four burgers. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Are you serious? So for contactless, uh, for contactless deliveries, what do you guys do? Like, do you still call a customer? Because I just take a photo and put that off by the front door, and that's it. I assume that it was really just for like when COVID was pretty bad. <coughs> yeah, I don't know, that's what I do now. Yeah, I'm just wondering like if that's even a thing anymore. <laughs> I just dropped those two orders off, Plantology and Panera, and now I am 
on my way back to where all the restaurants are that I go to. So just got ordered a wing stop and it's funny because it says like 8.7 miles for like 10.50 or something. But for some reason, as you can see, it looks like I have to do like four loops or something to get to Wingstop, when in reality, I just go to Wingstop and then I just go straight from there to her house. And it's actually like 1.4 miles. So I'm getting $10 for 1.4 miles. I actually like the Wingstop orders here because somehow DoorDash, like the app is like, I don't know, weird with that. So I always make more money than it says, but now it's raining. That's fun. Thank you so much. Yeah, uh oh, that's not good. I got a drink on me. I gotta park closer. Three hours later. It's asking me again like no I don't I don't want it I don't want your shit order I just got order to P I don't even know P Terry's burger stand for 850 for 5.3 miles So that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment below if you want and give this video a like, please, because it will greatly help the algorithm. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.